welcome back to my channel. I am Natasha Charmaine and if you are new here, please be sure to hit that subscribe button and if you enjoy this video, give me a thumbs up. To everyone else, welcome back to my channel and happy new year. Oh my god, I feel like I haven't seen you guys since last year, <laughs> which I haven't. Um, I'm hoping everyone is having a great new year. Uh, and a good holiday from last year and I can't believe it's 2022 um, the holidays last year were a little crazy um, I celebrated a birthday on the 24th of December Christmas Eve and um, I in turn got sick on that day um, I'll probably put up the video of when we went out and the stuff that we did it's not a lot of stuff because again it was still quiet but there were a lot of issues here and there so might make for a good video i don't know um but we'll see and um the holidays were pretty quiet and so because i was sick i didn't uh post a video yet for the year i try to post every saturday and um i missed january 1st which was the first saturday of the new year and uh, of course because i was sick i am still feeling a little <clears throat> in the throat area but for the most part i'm I'm well, I'm okay, and I'm hoping that you guys are staying safe and you are well as well. Um, so for 2022, um, I've got a lot of things that I'd like to do. Um, I am not the, uh, you know, New Year's resolution setter kind of person. I like to set goals for myself and I do like to try to um, accomplish those, but I'm not all about the new year, new me. I'm the same me. <laughs> Um, if anything, uh, my style has evolved a little and um, baby Milan is going to be two this year. I feel like I just had her. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to do a two-year-old birthday. That's going to be great this year. I'm going to do that really nicely this year. And um, just a whole bunch of other things that I want to work on. Um, tell me if you guys, leave a comment below and let me know. When you set your New Year's resolutions, do you actually at the end of the year look back and say, well, I hit this goal, I hit that goal, I hit all these goals? Because now that I'm thinking about it, I don't even know if I even hit my goals that I made last year. I know I definitely hit one of them and that was to lose the baby weight uh, from having baby Milan and I hit that goal really nicely. Um, I'll do a video on that, on my weight loss and uh, where I plan to go from here because it's not over. You still have to maintain the weight that you've lost and all of that great stuff. But um, this is a very long-winded intro. I do apologize. Um, I wanted to stop by and give you guys a little outfit inspo and also just share with you some of the items that I did pick up in December because I consider December my birthday month, not just a birthday because that's how we celebrate when you're an adult and when you are adulting, you get a whole month for your birthday. So I bought myself some stuff and um, I just want to show you how I styled them, give you guys some outfit inspiration so that you can start off the new year on a good note. Um, I know a lot of times we look in our closets and we're like, I've got all these clothes, but yet I can't find anything to wear. So to get you guys get out of that rut, I'm just going to show you some of the stuff that I got and I hope that you like it. I'll link everything below. More than likely these things will be on sale by now because I got them in December but they're really great pieces some of them and um, yeah let's get into it. Alright so one of the first things that I bought was this cardigan sweater. And I saw this one and I was like, oh my God, I gotta have it. It's um, it's like an off-white ivory color and it's got like this gold tinseling in it. And what drew me to this sweater were the sleeves. The sleeves are so exaggerative. They've got like this frilly curl all in them. If you um, but this crop sweater is amazing. It's got these really round big buttons that I absolutely love and uh, it's a v-neck cut. And the sleeves on this are just so 
so amazing. I just can't get past it. Now, what's really good about this sweater is that you can pretty much wear it with anything, as we always say. You can wear it with jeans like I am, and um, you can wear it with a black skirt. You can wear it with black pants, black denim. I wouldn't wear it with white. I don't think that that would pretty much complement it or anything, but um, it would also look good with leather pants, uh, leather shorts, leather skirts. Maybe even a denim skirt might look really good with it as well. Um, these are pretty much casual outfits. So I'm just trying to show you how to maybe elevate your look even with a casual wear. Um, right here I'm wearing my Steve Madden wedge pumps. And um, you know, that's just to give me a little oomph because I am pretty short. <laughs> and I like to be tall. I like, I like to do things to make myself look as tall as I possibly could nice and long and lean you know going for the look and um this sweater is great it's even got the ruffle around the shoulders that i absolutely love which gives it that like shoulder pad vibe i'm so digging the whole 80s shoulder pad thing oh i love it if i can find some blazers and stuff that's got like the shoulder pads in them ah. Oh. I think I'll get some of those this uh, this year and see how they work out for me. But yeah, so that's my sweater and uh, cardigan. I hope you like this one. So let's get into the next item. So the next item that I picked up, I've already started getting compliments on this. People have been asking me where I got this sweater from. And the day that I wore it, I swear to God, I must have gotten about 10 compliments on it. People were looking at me and I couldn't tell why they were looking at me. You know, sometimes when you go somewhere and you find people like staring at you and you're like, it's her problem or what's his problem? Why are they staring at me? You know what I mean? But I didn't realize that they were looking at my sweater. And then some people would actually say to me, oh my God, your sweater. Like, and I'm like, is that what it is? So I paid attention and I still found people looking at me, but they weren't looking at me. They were looking at the sweater and I realized it and I noticed it. So that only tells me that I made a really good choice with this. This sweater is to die for. Like the balloon sleeve thing is like out of this world. I absolutely love the way it like hangs off your shoulder and then it comes all the way down to your wrist in like this big exaggerative balloon look. I love it. And what's more is that this sweater comes in several different colors, but I chose chartreuse. Chartreuse is like, one of my favorite colors now. I loved green for as long as I can remember, like that apple green, but this chartreuse sweater is the bomb. You guys gotta check this one out, and you wouldn't believe where I got it from. Got it from Walmart. And looking at it, it just elevates the denim that I'm wearing, and it takes that casual look, and it just elevates it a little bit more. So if you guys like this sweater, it's linked below. It comes in all different colors. And um, I think this is a really good pick for an outfit of the day. So let's get into the next item. <sighs> all right, so these two pieces that I picked up are from different stores, but these are two pieces that I did pick up back in December that I wanted to get for my birthday. Uh, the first one is, I'm gonna start with the sweater. So it's an houndstooth sweater, and I chose to give it a little bit more of a flair by adding a white collar shirt, button down shirt with it. It gives it more of an elevated look, and I absolutely love that. And I also purchased this in an oversize. It's in large, but I'm normally a medium, but I wanted to get that baggy effect, so I put I bought a large, and it fits really, really great. This sweater also, believe it or not, is from Walmart. Okay, Walmart was really doing their thing last season. I ain't mad at them at all look at that look look just look at that houndstooth it looks really good i love it i love this sweater this is definitely one of my faves that i bought and also the pants are a pair of leather joggers that i picked up from macy's as well when i picked up the sweater with the frills on the sleeve um these were really good uh they have like side pockets and it's also got elastic waist and it's got elastic around the ankles. So that gives it that jogger style that I like. I wanted it to have that casual look, but I also still wanted to elevate it a little bit more 
by adding the sweater with the uh, button down collared shirt. So check those two items out. Pants are from Macy's and the top is from Walmart. So let's get into the next item that I got. All right, so in keeping with the leather jogger pants and with the, um, the wedge sneakers that I have on and the button down white shirt, I threw over um, this white or off white, it's like a creamy color. It's all cashmere and it's like a vest with a mock neck. I don't even know what to call it. It's a vest basically, cause it's not a full sweater, but I absolutely love it. It's 100% cashmere and it's super soft. It's super warm and the ivory color just takes that casual look and elevates it a little bit more. Now this particular uh, vest, sweater vest that I got, I got this from J. Crew, and right now J. Crew, well not right now, but in the beginning of December, J. Crew was doing a really great cashmere sale, and you know cashmere never goes on sale. So I said I just gotta pick this one up. Now this was the actual outfit that I wore on my birthday. I just switched out the wedge pumps uh, the wedge sneakers, I switched those out for a pair of uh, booties with heels and it looked really classy, really sophisticated and really edgy at the same time. So I really loved that look. This sweater vest, I got so many compliments on. Everyone was like, where did you get that? Oh my God, it's gorgeous. I'm like, yeah, yeah, it's cashmere. They're like, it is? And I'm like, yeah, they're like, yeah, it's so pretty. It looks so soft. And I'm like, that's because it is. <laughs> Um, so you guys check this one out. This is the sweater vest, 100% uh, cashmere, and you can get this one at J. Crew. So let's get into the next item that I got. Now this one, this was a sweater that I just wanted to have. I wanted to have that nice casual sweater, and it kind of gives me like that, I don't want to say it in a disrespectful way, but it kind of gives me that that bum vibe that you know like you don't care you just took an old sweater from out the garbage and just threw it on <laughs> i know it sounds bad but it has like that teddy bear color to it that i really really liked and i pretty much wear it with anything i think i wore this sweater at least 10 times already and i literally just got it like i throw it on with everything with sweatpants with jeans like I go out to the store, it's the first thing that I grab for and I threw it on with a pair of sweatpants. Um, in this particular video though, I threw it on with the white button down shirt again and a pair of jeans. And I think what I like the most about it is the fact that it has those buttons on the side. So you can like open them and leave them open and give that shoulder open vibe. Or you can button them up and you'll just have three buttons right on the side to just style your sweater. But I absolutely love it. And if you really look close enough, you can see that it's starting to just peel a little bit because I've been wearing it so much. So I'm just gonna have to put that one in the cleaners and get them to fix it up for me. But um, if you look at the sweater, it's a little short, a little cropped in the front, and then it comes down a little bit longer in the back. So it gives it a really cool vibe. And um, this was like my, my go-to sweater for 2021 in December. I kid you not, I threw this on all the time. So what I ended up doing also is that I paired it with a pair of booties that I had gotten for my birthday. Now I needed a pair of booties in this particular color like brown and I couldn't find a pair. My honey was able to find a pair for me. These are Sam Edelman and um, I think he had gotten them from like DSW and they are super cute. The only thing that I wasn't crazy about is just that it has like that ombre tone in the front and in the back. And then right on the heel, I do like that it has the little Sam Edelman uh, symbol. They're super cute. And then it's got like the three little buttons on the side of the boot to make it look like that's how it buttons up. But that's just the style of it because it has a zip where you put your foot in and you just zip it up. But these boots came in clutch because I needed a pair of boots in this brown color and they worked out perfect. So check out those two items. We've got the brown sweater with the buttons on the side that I got from J. Crew, and then the boots, which are Sam Edelman. You can probably get them from Sam Edelman or you can try DSW and they may have them as well. So that's two more items. Uh, so let's see what the other item is. I think I have one more that I picked up. 
Yes, 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 yes. All right, so this last item that I picked up, I am a Blazers fan. Um, I don't think too many people know that I love blazers. I've always loved blazers. I got my first, um, how can I say it, luxury type blazer a few years ago that my honey bought for me and I really, really wanted it. And I'd gotten it, he'd gotten it from J. Crew. And um, this blazer is also from J. Crew. And I just love that camel color. It's just such a natural color and it looks really good on my complexion. So I can see myself wearing a lot of pieces in this particular color this year. Um, so in this styling video, I paired it again with my white button down shirt and a pair of jeans. And I think I also have it on with my uh, Sam Edelman boots. Um, but what I like about this blazer that I like about all of J. Crew blazers is that on the inside of their blazers, they always have pockets. Now, I, I know that men's suit always come with inside pockets, and that was the one thing I always said. Why don't stores and departments and brands make their blazers like that for women? It's so unfair. That is such a cool feature to have. And now that I know, well, since then I've known that J. Crew does it. Oh my God, I am so into their blazers. I like to take my cell phone and just pop it in my pocket and people see me and I'm like, look at her. She's just, you know, doing it. Like, she got a pocket in there? What? I love it. I love it. This blazer is also, it says it's um, from the British cloth and it's 100% wool and it's got a beautiful lining and it's got like a pink uh, piping to offset the color of the blazer. And this was a really, really good buy. J. Crew blazers are not cheap. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you, but they are the best, the best, I would call them investment pieces because you'll have a J. Crew blazer for like a really long time to come. I've had my blazer now for maybe four or five years and I don't plan on giving it up. Uh, this particular one is in a size six and um, it's more on the fitted side because I plan to wear it to the office and I have worn it to the, the office a few times with um, skirts, uh, pants and people have given me compliments. Oh, I love your blazer. I love oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> but yeah, so I think those are all the pieces that I got for the holidays for my birthday. Um, I did pick up some jewelry. Um, this particular one that I got is from the, I think it's called uh, Demi Find and they come in this cute little pouch and uh, the necklaces and the charm pieces are 100, I'm sorry, 14 karat gold plated. And um, these pieces that they sell are a little bit more pricier than the costume jewelry that they usually carry. Uh, this particular necklace, I love it. It clasps in a, what do you call that? The circle with the stick that goes through. It's really cute, that's all I can tell you. And I love the style of it. And then the charm that I picked up is, um, it's a green piece. I don't know what material that the green circle is, but it has a snake around it that has like a green eye. I thought it was gorgeous and I just had to have it. Um, so yeah, I did pick up a few pieces from them. Um, also, the earrings that I'm wearing, I don't know if you can see, these are also a Demi Fine, these pearl earrings that they have. I thought they were really great and super cute, so I picked those up as well. Charm. I also picked up a second charm. It has, uh, this is like the sun, because they had like a celestial vibe going on with candles and their necklaces and, you know, sun, star, and moon and stuff, so I got the sun. And uh, these charms are really cool because they have clips and you can just kind of clip it on to your necklace. So I got that recently. Oh, and one other thing. I don't know if where you guys are located in the world, but we got some snow the other day and I had to go out and get a pair of boots. Um, the boots that I had, the zip was spoiled on it and I for totally forgot about that. Like nobody's thinking about that in the summer, you know what I mean? So when you really need them and then you go to put them on, it's a wrap, the, the, the zipper is spoiled. So I did go out and get a pair of boots from J. Crew as well. I got these, 
Um, I don't remember what they're called, um, but I will look it up. I'll link them for you. And it was these and another pair that I saw. They were brown or camel, okay, and they had like the shirling around it. They were really nice, but I was convinced to get these pair because these are 100% leather and then also right around the boot all the way around this is rubber so this will do a much better job in the snow and with the salt and everything it won't help my boots to deteriorate or anything because this is all rubber um, and I really like them because as you can see it has the zip is on the top as opposed to the side or the back and um, it's got the faux shirling around it which is pretty cool um you can wear like leggings or if you're wearing like um skinny jeans you can let that go inside and then the shirling will be out or even if you're wearing wide leg boot leg or straight leg jeans which will go over it and you won't see it so it'll look just like you know it'll look like a kind of like a booty shoe type thing you know what i mean but i think these are a really good buy i actually wore them the other day if you can see it's a little stayed from the snow um, and they did a good job they held up pretty well so I'm very happy with this purchase and um, I'll link these below as well I don't think like I'm, I'm from I'm in New York so I don't think this is gonna be the end of our snow season honestly so I'm ready all right so that's everything guys that is everything oh my gosh you have no idea how long it took me to make this video a few hours to be quite honest because i had computer trouble then i had camera trouble i had to format my disc i mean it's just always something it's never easy i'm gonna be real with you this is not easy it takes time so if you're looking to do a youtube channel if you've thought about it just think about the things that you got to get into and the things that you need to know and the things that you need to learn i'm not saying that it's hard i'm just saying it's challenging but if you want it bad enough you will do it so uh thank you guys for rocking with me on this video um for 2022 i plan on bringing you guys fashion beauty lifestyle you know more about the hair updates because it's coming along nicely and i kid you not i get 50 million comments on my curls and it's just amazing how people are taking to it um, I'm not gonna make this outro as winded as my intro I will save that for something else so I thank you guys for rocking with me I'm now at 200 subscribers and I've decided that I am gonna go ahead and grow my channel so I'm hoping that you guys will stick it out with me you'll be here for me you'll stay committed to me um subscribe if you haven't already give me a thumbs up leave comments below people leave me comments below any questions that you have whether it's about the hair or the clothes or the baby or anything just always leave me comments let me know that you like the vid cute vid whatever you want to do it's so important to help me grow my channel and i appreciate you guys being here so on that note i'm gonna go see you guys in my next video.